Hello everyone. In today's video, we're gonna cover this board. That's the uh, Seed Studio. Um, I mean Seed Xiao uh, RP2040. That's a powerful board. Okay, uh, we can do many good stuff uh, with this uh, board. Okay. So that's from Seed Studio, and uh, it has uh, 40 pins. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, six, seven. Okay, uh, 14 pins in total. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how to configure. Okay, how to program. Uh, this uh, face board with uh, um, Arduino ID okay so we're gonna see how to install the board for this microcontroller okay and um, after that we're gonna read okay the data coming from uh, this temperature and humidity sensor okay so now i'm going to do the connections okay i'm going to put the board on this side of the breadboard like so okay now um Uh, this pin is the uh, 5 volts okay the one is the ground the second pin and uh, the third pin is the 3.3 uh, uh, volts okay and um, so uh, that's mozi uh, I don't know mozi uh, mice I don't know so I'm going to show you the uh, the pin out okay That's the uh, pinout. So now I'm going to go ahead and uh, connect my sensor on this side of the bread of the breadboard. Okay, like so. So the third, let me see. Uh, the pin is the uh, signal. Okay, S signal. The middle pin, you can guess. Okay, is the uh, VCC. Of course, with here minus okay. That the main is the uh, our ground. So I'm going to connect that in here like so. Now we're gonna use to um, we're gonna connect okay the signal uh, pin to Xiao Seed RP2040 okay uh, um, so we're gonna use the uh, pin uh, the pin let me see 27 okay uh, that's the pin 27 and uh, the ground no, that's the VCC, is the middle pin, VCC, 5 volts, okay, 5 volts, and uh, the, that's the ground, okay, ground is, um, ground is here, it is here, okay. So now let me show you how to configure uh, this board with Arduino ID. Okay, uh, we need to, I mean, that's the program, the sketch of today's video. Okay, that's the uh, pin 27 that uh, we're going to be using. 
and um, so um, that's the uh, we're gonna read the uh, temperature and the humidity uh, um, yeah you 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 made it uh, data okay uh, so uh, now we need to install the board okay we go to board manager and uh, we type okay uh, we type rp2040 and uh, we're gonna install okay the board arduino arduino i don't know arduino yeah that's so you need to install so you need to install this board to be able to program the microcontroller okay so you uh, uh, you also need to to install the uh, this library okay dht sensor library and uh, we're gonna put the link in the description of this video and uh, you also need to install uh, adfruit sensor library okay so the project to work okay and uh, i'm going to put uh, uh, these the links okay in the description now after uh, installing the board now here um adding okay uh, these two libraries okay so i've already done it okay for the uh Alfred sensor library okay and uh, i'm going to try adding the dht library that uh, which i've already done it okay as you can see the message okay here it's already done okay so now um we need to to plug in the uh, okay the cable so we can upload the sketch now you after uh, um, installing the board you need to to go to tool, tools and board and you and you uh choose okay raspberry uh pi pico i think pi pico i think that's the uh, pronunciation okay now here um uh, uploading the sketch okay um okay okay so we wait a few seconds and um to yeah it's done now we, we go to serial monitor and uh, we can see we are reading the sensor uh, values okay the uh, the sensor data okay uh, that's the uh, the data coming from the uh, dht sensor uh, we are reading the um, the humidity and the temperature uh, sensor, I mean, data. Thank you so much.